Hello and welcome to the Bike Century. My name's Ben and today I'm really excited to be able to show you for the first time uh, the new CF Moto CLX 700 Adventure. Uh, now three versions of the 700. Um, this the Adventure, the Sport and uh, of course the Heritage of which this is based on. Um, obviously with a name like Adventure as you would expect it's uh, a scrambler uh, aimed at those who want to do occasional off-roading, um, who want a comfortable durable day-to-day uh, -day bike. CF Moto, if you're not familiar with them, probably the best brand that you've never heard of. They're distributed by KTM, they've got a long standing relationship with them. Um, and uh, we've been CF Moto dealers for just over a year. It's a fantastic product, uh, and we've been waiting for this to come into the UK. So it's powered by a 693cc parallel twin, um, same as in the other two bikes, and that produces just over 60 brake horsepower. Um, it weighs around about the 200 kilogram sort of mark. Um, and yeah, it's aimed at uh, the Ducati Scrambler market, I would say, you know, Triumph Scrambler, that sort of thing. Um, as I said, based on the, the heritage frame and chassis, so it looks and feels very familiar with a slightly higher uh, seat height, more ground clearance, uh, slightly longer travel on the front suspension, um, wire wheels, as you can see, with tubed Pirelli tyres, um, so they're, they're not scrimping on the tyres, uh, it's got proper kit on it. Um, CF Moto use Juan brakes. Uh, I'll show you those as we go around the other side. But Juan is a subsidiary of Brembo, so uh, really good quality brakes and uh, comes with ABS as well. Cosmetically, there's a couple of different colorways. This is like a satin finish, I would say like a blue green. I don't know if the camera does it justice really, um, but it does look really, really nice in this color. Everything is finished really nicely. As with any CF Moto, the engine casings and everything are all painted uh, black and you've got a couple of different uh, accents on here. This dark gun metal gray on the tank uh, and the silver sides as, uh, as well. This is a Euro 5 bike, so if you're commuting into a ultra low emission zone, you're going to have no issues there. Again, on the back, we've got a Pirelli rear with a, uh, a tubed tyre. The, um, the number plate holder actually is, uh, is set uh, off of the swing arm, which is obviously becoming more common. The main reason for that is the EU law dictates that the number plate has to be behind the rear wheel. And as you can see, the 700 CLX has got short, uh, stumpy rear end, so um, you just wouldn't be able to mount it on there without it looking a bit crap, really. Different seat to the Heritage. As I've said, it is slightly higher. It comes with the luggage mount, so there is a CF Moto specific luggage that fits onto these. Uh, a more rearward mounted pillion grab rail as well, because it does have quite a short rear seat. So um, they've uh, they've added the, the 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 additional grab rail for pillions as well. Really nicely finished on the tank. Again, I don't think the camera quite does the colour justice. It's almost like a marine sort of colour changing blue green. Looks really, really nice. LEDs all around. It's got the same uh, really nice LED headlights. So this lights up with the X symbol on it. There's lots of uh, X symbols, marks all over the bike. <clears throat> Another key difference between this uh, and the standard CLX Heritage is the screen and slightly taller, higher bars. So uh, again, all aimed at um, a more off-road adventure style of riding. Semi-adjustable forks. So you've got preload, high and slow speed compression dampening. Again, all aimed at the off-road rider. Um, let's take a look at the brakes. So there's those huge uh, Juan front discs um, and four pot radially mounted calipers with braided lines and ABS. Um, fantastic front end, really good brakes. Uh, good suspension on these are standard as well. The engine is a derivative of a Kawasaki engine. So you might be more familiar with uh, the Z650 engine. Uh, the parallel comes from that, but it's actually partnered with uh, Bosch Electronics. So, um, so it's a really good, well-known system. Chain driven, as you can see, really easy adjustment on these. Uh, if you're doing any home maintenance, this is quite an easy bike to look after. CF Moto's come with a four year warranty, um, which is fantastic. Uh, you know, it's not something you would traditionally see on a bike at this sort of price point. Um, lots and lots of nice uh, additions are standard. So you've got span, span adjusters on both the clutch um, and brake cleavers, again, all quality stuff provided by uh, Juan as well. Um, the bike comes with uh, cruise control. So again, sort of aimed at that, uh, that touring adventure market. It's got a fully digital dash. This is the same on the Heritage, but not on the Sport. The Sport dials are slightly different. Um, two rider modes, so you've got a street mode uh, and also an off-road mode, which obviously uh, changes the ABS settings. 
your rev counter goes around the outside. Uh, obviously, you've got a clock, speed, your rodeo trips, you've got a, a fuel gauge just down here as well. Give it a start up. <laughs> It's a very familiar sounding engine obviously the parallel twins are, are cheap to run uh, low maintenance um, and obviously very robust and reliable as uh, you know as i said it's a tried and tested engine that's been seen in lots of kawasaki uh, motors to date <clears throat> so we're main dealers for cf moto so we can offer things like finance part exchange delivery um, we do all the accessories for cf moto as well warranty repairs that sort of thing so if you're interested in this bike or any of the other 700 clx range uh, please feel free to reach out. We've got WhatsApp, live chat, all the social medias. Please feel free to pick up the phone and ask us any questions that you've got, or you can drop into the showroom and try the bike on for size. That's it from me. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to speaking to you soon. Take care.